Well, hello and welcome back to my channel. I was not planning on vlogging today at all, but I have to share the monstrosity that is Minnesota on April 3rd. I mean, this is freaking ridiculous, y'all. Hold on, I will show you. Outside of my front door, there's no April showers at all. Check this out. Like, what the heck is this crap? See that blowing stuff? Yep, it's snow. Like these drifts, what the heck? My front door is covered in snow. Covered. Covered in snow. Ew, yuck. Gross, right? But my wreath looks kind of festive right now. I need to switch that out soon. This whole thing is horrible. Good thing Doyle went outside already and went to the bathroom, like his big walk, cause oh my gosh. What's up mother nature? Figure out your life. Like just to give you guys like a pretty good view, like that's quite tall. That's like a good, like that ridge right here. That's like a good foot and a half at least. Mind you, the ridge was accumulation over the last couple of days, but still like that's nuts. Um, when I took Doyle out, it was still quite warm. Uh, now it's the evening time now, so it's getting cooler out, so the snow is kind of sticking to the ground now. So, yeah. But it's been like blowing snow, like all flipping day. Let's see. <gasps> Doity! What are you doing, boo boo? Hmm? You licking your paws? Yep. He likes to lick his paws. Because Sheba paws are extra delicious. Hey, leave your paws alone. Leave those paws alone, sir. Oh, I know. He's like, pet me, please. And he does not want to go outside anymore. What's going on over there? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, hold on. I was going to show you guys. I'm in my guest room right now. Show you guys outside. I can get this dang thing to work, hold on. That used to be my driveway. Yep. The plows haven't come by yet just because it hasn't stopped snowing yet. So they don't come by until they till it stops snowing. But oh my goodness gracious. But good news, tomorrow it's not supposed to snow. I was actually talking to my mom, was it today? Yesterday, oh my gosh, I look like a hot mess today, but that's all right. I don't mind being messy. And for lunch, budget conscious Emily had some lasagna leftovers. They were really, really kind of, it was really pretty good, um, reheated. So yeah, Doyle, you look so sad, little buddy. Oh, <laughs> you're so sad, buddy boy. He likes to lay on all the blankets, let me tell you guys. So, yeah, that's what's happening here. It is just like crazy snowing. I don't understand. It's like, it's April. It's supposed to be warmer and not dealing with freaking snow. It's supposed to be raining. That's the idea. But, um, oh yeah, I was talking to my mom because she's coming in March. No, she's coming in May. Gosh, I can't talk. And she'll be here like the very beginning of May cause she is going to be here right before I go to go wild and she's gonna stay here um, and then, you know, stay with Doyle while I'm gone. But um, she's like, it better not snow in May. I'm like, mom, you lived here for the majority of your life. It does snow in May sometimes, unfortunately. Sometimes it does. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> So when people from the north talk about it snowing like literally for half the year, we're not kidding. It does sometimes snow for half the year. <laughs> sometimes the snow starts in October here. Usually it starts in November, but sometimes it does start in October. And sometimes it doesn't quit until May. Yeah, so it's quite a long time to have snow type temperatures, yeah. So anyway, I think what I'm going to do now is um, I need to make some dinner of some sort. I would finish up my um, lasagna from last night, but I feel like that's like too much because I ate that for lunch too. So 
Um, speaking of lunch, I still have my ginger ale that's sitting over here that I have not finished all of yet. Mm. Oops, I have like a little bit left of my ginger ale. Maybe I should finish this. I'm also debating like what like my new video should be. I think I'm gonna do a plan with me, but I'm gonna do that tomorrow. It's been so overcast today. I was gonna do one today, but I hate using artificial lights. Like even my light right there, you guys can see. I don't even like to put that on because it just makes these weird shadows that I don't like in my videos. So um, like when I do my like overhead hand videos, I do it on my dining table. But man, um, it was just, it's been so dark out. Like it's, you can't really tell, but it is quite dark out today. But this is kind of how it's been all day and it's 6.45 right now. So the sun is definitely setting, but it's just been like kind of overcast and just like not like dark outside, like dark overcast, which is weird. But I think, I'm pretty sure it's because of all the weather and the snow and all that stuff because it just hasn't been doing anything. But this weather is like, I'm kind of glad I don't have a job right now because I don't have to go anywhere. <laughs> but yikes, oh my gosh, let me show you guys my backyard, holy moly. So those like tables and that table right there, which you can't see the whole thing, are on the ground. Like that's how much snow is in my backyard right now. Crazy, right? And then this whole thing like the back right there that's like the ground you know i don't think it's coming off on camera but it is snowing quite heavily but it's it's hard to see because it's like white on white you can't really see it very well but it is still coming down quite a bit so it's gonna keep snowing here for a little while um i'm not sure when it's supposed to end let me check my little like i have this like weather bug app on my phone and um it's usually quite accurate but it tells you like an hourly of like what's supposed to be happening. So it's supposed to be snowing until the eight o'clock hour or into the eight o'clock hour. So by nine, it says it's supposed to like clear up. And then tomorrow it's supposed to be like sunny and amazing. And then Thursday is supposed to be fine. Friday is supposed to be fine. And Saturday and Sunday. But you know, if you go out like too far in your weather bug app, like eh. Eh, it's kind of a crapshoot at that point, but yeah, usually the day of it's like quite accurate. So yeah, but oh my gosh, it's just like insanity. Oh, I can show you guys something fun. I got a um, coffee break planner order and I know I've been on a no spend. I get like PR stuff from them. So let me show you what I got. So I think I'm gonna use some of these in my plan with me, but I'm not like 100% sure. I kinda wanna go with a theme this week, but not sure what I wanna do yet in my plan with me because I haven't even done it yet. But I did get some of these foiled scallop boxes, these event stickers, which I think are so pretty. This is the gold foil. This one, I can't remember the name of it. I wanna say it's like titanium foil. It's like a dark silver, which I think is so pretty. This one is the holographic. Oh, it's so pretty. I love it. Um, and then I got some little fair decorative, like a little small decorative sheet. These, I believe, go with it. Um, there's just some primary half boxes because, you know, well, I don't need more half boxes in my life, of course. These are so cool. Um, I didn't even know that these were up in her shop, and I saw them, and I'm like, Catherine, I need those in my life. So um, these are just a cute little, like, no spend. Um, you know, a lot of people have been talking to me about doing no spends, but then they wanted to do, like, a like one week of a no spend or two weeks of a no spend or something. So I think these stickers would be really nice in your planner if you're planning on doing something like that or if you just want to track for the month and just, you know, put in the days that you don't spend anything, but then obviously the days that you like pay a bill or go get gas or, you know, whatever you need to do, like don't use it on one of those days, but they're just like cute little things. I think that's so cool. And then um, got some of these because I'm still, I've gotten a lot of questions if I'm still going on my Alaskan cruise and yes, I am. So I figured I might use some of those during this because kind of like more of a nautical half box. And then I got two of these different patterns, of course, but these are kind of more of a purple and green. And then this one's like a 
more of like a gray and like a pink blossom color. So I thought those were really pretty. But yeah, I think that these are a great thing to have. These are not in the Emily's budget bundle. They're just a like standalone sheet by their own. So I will leave Coffee Break Planners, I can't do it. I'll leave Coffee Break Planners information um, down below if you guys are interested in um, checking out some things. Also, um, there's a coupon code down below too for 20% off of your entire order. And I don't believe that there are, I don't believe there's a minimum with that 20% off. I don't know if there is, but I'm pretty sure there's not a minimum. But anyway, try the code on Etsy and see if it works. So yeah. And to be honest, I believe, I think that her stickers are really, really well priced for planner stickers. Oh, also this is what she gave me too. Yep. Super cute, cute things, yep, yep. So yeah, that is um, kind of what's happening here. I haven't, hmm, I feel like I just wanted to tell you about the weather. <laughs> That's weird. Maybe this will be just like a one take vlog, but I'll just clip out the parts where I'm not talking or I'm just walking around and wanting to show you guys something. So anyway, I think that's gonna be it for this little vlog. I just wanted to say hi and have you check out the weather. Hmm. Crazy, right? I'm pretty sure um, as soon as it stops, um, the plows will be out, like the, like the city plows will be out plowing, and then our association will be out plowing after that, which means if it's gonna stop around like eight, thir eight between eight and nine, the plows, like our plows, that scrape the driveways and do all that stuff, those will probably be out about like 3 a.m. So um, I'll definitely be woken up in the middle of the night. They tend to do that. So, and that's fine. I mean, it has to get done, so I understand. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna eat some dinner here. I'll probably edit this video and get it up for you guys today, but just wanted to show you Minnesota. So if you live in a warmer climate, please send your warm vibes through the interwebs, please, because this stuff is nasty. Like, ugh, it was super slushy when I went out for um, the walk with Doyle. I actually had to, carry him for part of it because he does not like um, stepping in puddles and it was like literally like stepping in puddles in some areas of our walk so thankfully I have these like really uh, big winter boots that are waterproof so I can step in the puddles so I carried him like I just kind of <coughs> carried him for uh, the portion of the walk that we walked back so and then once it was um, not a dry road but like a non-slushy road, I put him back down so he could just walk the rest of the way, but he didn't seem to mind it because he really, really doesn't like to have his paws uh, be wet at all. <laughs> so anyway, I've yammed on for way too long. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed um, this clip of all of the crazy things that are happening in Minnesota. Send your warm vibes. Feel free to thumbs up the video if you liked it. Also, if you have any questions, you can put them down below and um, hit the little bell notifications when I upload more videos. Hopefully I'll be able to do that plan with me tomorrow and um, if I am, then I will upload that tomorrow for you too. So anyways, I uh, hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.